our trip to the northwest coast of Vancouver Island, up by Kayukit at Rugged Point Lodge, we got into some absolutely unreal lingcod, some giants, some beasts. There's a place where everything makes sense. Wading a blue ribbon stream, on a boat on the ocean, or casting into the pristine waters of an untouched lake. For as long as I can remember, I've been obsessed with the wild. Fishing has always been a way of life for me and my family. Come along and enjoy some of our adventures. Welcome to Wild Angles. Like what on earth are we pulling up right now? I can't believe it, look the size of its head! What a crazy fight! This fish does not even fit in my neck. Oh, that is a solid, solid fish. That is a tank of a salmon. Hi, I'm Aiden Dunning. Welcome to Wild Angles. On today's episode, we're with Rugged Point Lodge and we're going to be targeting some gnarly lingcod. So lingcod are a species I've been targeting for a few years. I used to live in a coastal town and I would take my little 12 foot tin boat out and uh, I'd go into 400 foot deep holes and I'd jig them up and I'd, I'd caught a lingcod before. It was only about four pounds, but I've never really caught that big of a lingcod. So this trip here is going to hopefully make up for that. We'll see how it goes. Good morning. How you doing? Great. How are you doing? Good. Good. Looks, Looks like, like the, the fog's lifting, eh? Yeah. Yeah, it's super nice. You can actually see the hills over there. Yeah. yeah. So the uh, bottom, see the, you got 30 feet of 130 on there. Okay. And then the, all the other, every color is 10 feet. Okay. And it's 80 pound. So it, it won't get dragged back as Yeah. Those are stout little rods, eh? Lots of backbone. Yeah, well look what you're digging. <laughs> yeah. So how much does that weigh? That's 32 ounces. So two pounds? Yeah. And then the pipe. Can you believe that? <laughs> That's such a crazy jig. Yeah, link I like using <laughs> copper and lead. <laughs> Who would have thunk, eh? A copper pipe for a wing cod jig. <laughs> this is pretty exciting. We're here. We're here to fish some lingcod. Okay. You grab your rod there and let her bombs away. Drop her all the way down to the bottom. Good. Yeah, like that. That's good. Dig it? Yeah. A little bit shorter jigs. Okay. Then let it drop the tip away so it flutters. Okay. There you go. And then you can just stop once in a while. And just, sometimes I'll just come and grab it. But that's it, yeah, just for a second. Oh, yeah. Good. Good. Good you want a fish? Me? Yeah. No. Okay. I mean. <laughs> Wanna get two rods going? 
Yeah, just keep, just keep jigging that. You gotta keep it moving. Yeah, that's right. Get off. Yeah. Okay. So when you're, when you're reeling, you don't want to give them any flat. Yeah. Oops. <laughs> you see how I got this? That's three. Yeah. Yeah. That's three. Yeah. Yeah. I better not waste any time. My mom might outfish me. <laughs> you got lady luck on your side. That's something I'll never have. <laughs> oh, Joe, we're late. We're moving. Oh, okay. Ready. Wild Angles is brought to you by All About Trout, Bass Dash, Cooley Outdoor, Hard Knocks Brewery, Maui Jim Sunglasses, National Emergency Safety Services, Pro Patria Coffee Company, Red Shed Fly Shop, Red Wings Tackle, Thule, and Tournament Marine and Power Sports. Where I've really got them, yeah, see this drop off right here? This went from 150 down to 170. Yeah, so we're just gonna pull up onto it. So when you drop, hit bottom, jig for a bit, and then hit. Let's run a slope, right? We're gonna, we're gonna pull us up into about 150, and then we'll fish down to 180. This is all good water right here. See how it's coming up along here? Which is layer of the ling cod. Okay, and okay, bombs away. Oh, that's heavy. <laughs> that's awesome, man. Holy! Oh, he's pulling drag! Oh, he's heavy! No! Oh, you bugger! Well, that was a heavy fish! Holy! Hopefully we can hook into something like that again! Dang! You know when they got this rod bent right over, it's a good fish. <laughs> That was a good one you had on there. That was for sure, it was heavy as hell. I couldn't gain anything on him, he just wanted to pull line. That's unfortunate he got off. I didn't give him any opportunity to get off. He must have just not had the hook good. Yeah. Damn, that drag's too tight. Yeah, but he spit it. He ate it on the way down. Oh, yeah. Set it down. Oh. Yeah. That's oh. it. Got something real heavy on. coming up slow this is a little heavier than the first two I got into and he smacked it like a freight train that is a lot of fun Yep. Nice and easy. 
Ooh. That's a better size fish, eh? Yeah, this is, this is a nice one. Nice, look at that. Look at that fish. That's an absolute stud. And the fish ain't bad either. <laughs> what do you think? I think she's talking about me. <laughs> or the cameraman. I was gonna say, it's, it's all about me. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that fish. What a tank of a lingcod, man. One thing that's always got me is the peck fins on these fish. They got big pecs. Absolutely gorgeous, man. Right on, man. Sweet, let's get him in the bin. Stop making a mess of the boat. <laughs> Closed captioning is brought to you by National Emergency Safety Services. Strength in emergency. Yeah, right on the top of this, there's going to be a big lane cod living. Okay. Using an almost two pound jig to jig up some awesome lane cod. Some greasy ling cod. They'll be delicious on the table though. That's a big jig. Yeah. It's amazing what you find in their stomachs. Oh, I bet. Yeah. Another ling cod, um, another rockfish, then we have uh, a rag, a rag fish. Rag fish yeah, Did you see that on our, on our website? Yeah. That was so cool. Yeah, apparently they live in the really deep water. Interesting. And which just outside of us here, it's 2,000 feet deep. Right. And, and we're up on a dropping at 150 and then drifting out over uh, 200. Once we get around 200 feet, we come back up. See the big school of bait fish on top there? Nice, lots of bait down there. Yeah, and I've also been seeing salmon on the sonar too while we're fit, jigging. Yeah, sometimes you'll get a salmon on one of those, believe it or not. Yeah, that's an ambitious salmon. No uh, doubt. Big bait for a salmon. Okay, drop them. Is it? Is it? It's pulling line. That's a fish, man. Is it? Yep. Yep, 100%. That's a fish. Oh, that's a fish. You can have a green up there. That'd be cool. <laughs> it's heavy. Yeah. Yeah, that's a fish for sure. It's just pulling line. Come to Papa. Holy. I don't know. But it was straight down though, it wasn't. Now it gave me a head shake like a fish. Yeah, it's coming up. I just tried to pull the hook out of it. Because it's coming up with us right now. It is bottom, it's fighting back. I tried to pull the hook out of it, that would have been bad. Just lose it. It's coming up a little bit. Oh, look at him pulling by. Little head 
Like what on earth are we pulling up right now? Link on it, big one, huge link on snagged to the butt. Huge, guys. big one. <laughs> what do you do with that? A little gas. Yeah, let's get him. Ready? Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> what? What is that? Is that What's in there? <laughs> Holy! Yeah. Yes. I know. Well, this is all chafed. It went right down. Got wrapped in the bottom there. Oh my! Oh my, that's a big one. Just have another gap there? Yeah, man, for sure. Take a 50-pound link cod. Can you hold him up? Yeah. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this fish! I can't believe it. Look at the size of its head. That is ridiculous. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> this is what dreams are made of right here. That is unreal, oh, man. That's a nice big one. <laughs> Holy cow. If you want to see some of the biggest link rod around, get your boat over to Rugged Point Lodge. This is unreal. Holy cow. Oh, man. I'm gonna drop him. <laughs> Rugged Point Lodge is a premier fishing destination off the northwest coast of Vancouver Island. After a good day of fishing, sit back and relax. Enjoy a delicious home cooked meal from their in house chef and then make your way out to the cozy fire to share your fishing stories. The link guide was like we almost had bottom. We went back and got, got wrapped around, but we pulled the boat out into the deep and then we started gaining on them and we knew it was a fish. It was hard to tell them at first. But it's a really steep spot. Like look on the... So we've just gone from 200 here up to 150, so it's a real steep oh, angle. I just landed when I was like 50 pounds. No way. Its head was this big, man, like this long. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a big one. The fishing out here today is unreal. There's so many fish biting the hooks. Cannot ask for anything more. That's a heavy one. Connected to another fish. Hard to beat. You get into a spot. You drop down. You hit bottom, reel up, and catch a fish. That is hard to beat. Oh. 
I'm at the night. Look at that one! That's pretty killer, man. <laughs> Another gorgeous link caught into the boat. What an absolute stunner. It's a big fish, like that's probably a 20 pound fish or something. Oh, yeah. Anyway, like, yeah, it's over 20, that one. Man, what an absolute stud. These fish are heavy. And they pull hard. Let's get them in the box and stop getting your boat on that thing. Okay. This is some fun fishing. This is something that anybody should get out and try. Unreal, man. Yeah. <laughs> There's an average of about 150 to 170 feet. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's what I did that. Deep water to be jigging up a two pound jig, but I'll tell you what, if that's where the fish are, that's where we gotta be. It's non-stop. You go out there, you drop a jig, you catch a fish. And these fish are absolutely unreal. Every one of these fish is around 20 pounds or up. The big one is close to 50s, 46. Absolutely amazing fishing. Follow us on social media at Wild Angles TV.